are you indicating that even as Ghana, we should have a look at our constitution again? And, oh, and, very much and so. And see whether we can very, tweak very a few so. things here and we there. Need not only to tweak, I think we need to overhaul the constitution. Because look, whether we like it or not, the current constitution was written, written within an environment that didn't have freedom. It was written for runners. I, I, you can or, say that. Or for a potential dictator. It was written for Ghanaians with clauses, clauses and uh, provisions that favored certain individuals. And that's not the constitution. Yeah. So the constitution had individuals in mind. And of when, you, when you do that, that's, when you start like that, you, you get, you get of it wrong. Course, of flawed. course, of course. You don't write constitution with an individual. If you're referring to the transitional provisions, that we can do away with now. You J can J do J away has with died. With. Nobody, that's correct. Nobody needs the and transitional the, provisions And the excessive anymore. accumulation of power at the center it's also That's a problem. very, very key. Yeah. Very key. And that was to reflect a dictator's appetite. Precisely. Mm. Exactly. You mm. got it right. Mm. So the whole notion of decentralization, that should have come. Today, everywhere in the country, people say rules are bad. Can you imagine if districts had the capacity to own at least one, two graders and rulers and caterpillars? Can't they be working on their roads? Why would they have to come to Accra? to ask for the Minister of Roads to please construct a three-kilometer road. Think of it. Does it make sense? Mm. Mm. We have centralized our system so much that others are being suffocated. So me, when I see people crying for roads for this and that, even at times a president goes somewhere and the chief stands up and they, what they're asking for is a toilet in their village. What happened to- It means our local look? government decentralized has failed miserably. <sighs> If you say that, I won't challenge you. Mm. Because we're looking so. for a unitary state where the power is in the center. That's correct. And that's what we created. And that's one of the With faults of the present constitution. That's why it was such a disappointment when the president said, let's amend it and people voted. And some people thought that the voting on political lines was so bad that we had to throw the baby away with the bathwater. Uh, that was just a, a step that he took. It wasn't a complete picture. Mm -hmm. Because uh, amending it and allowing the DCs to be voted for did not reflect whether the DCs will have the same economic capacitation. That's In other words, fiscal, fiscal decentralization. It yeah, but that's directed by law. So this assembly common fund is, is available from the constitution. But, but you see, the, the assemblies cannot rely exclusively on the common fund. So they have they, the capacity to... They can to, raise their own money. Exactly. Once exactly. they're elected, exactly. they, they should Precisely. be able to raise their own Precisely. money. Mm. So those things will have been added to that. Uh, ah, yeah, those advantages. Right. I think exactly. you're right. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. We we conduct. <laughs>